Behind every priest are people like you. Behind the priesthood are people like you. And when we become priests, we look back and we think of people like you and we say, thank God, I need to be a holy priest because the people who brought me here are holy themselves. Your love for Jesus Christ keeps us at the altar. Your fidelity to the church and your love for the vicar of, of St. Peter, vicar of Christ, the replacement of St. Peter, inspires us. What we do, we do for you and we do with you because you've done it for us. As you lay down your lives for each other, husband and wife, you model for us priests what we're supposed to do for you. Your fidelity to marriage, your fidelity to the pro-life movement, your fidelity to young people, your fidelity to the church. My goodness, you're leading us as you ask us to lead you. And together, we pull and push each other down that road to holiness. And it's such a beautiful thing that I am honored to stand here and say thank you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for sacrificing and moving. Thank you for saying yes to vocations. On the other end of it is heaven, is Jesus, and is so our souls for God.